Hello, YouTube. Dr. Solo coming to you from Bagada in Lagos, Nigeria. So, we, you're familiar with this inverter. So, Jinko obviously has labeled the Bayer inverter and they're selling it as theirs. They're also selling you this battery enclosure that costs quite almost the price of an actual battery. But they're all IP55, IP65. So, it allows us to install it outdoors without us worrying about um, dust or moisture causing damage to the equipment. So this is this has four modules in it and I wish I could open it and show you, but I cannot. And I like I like the way they have it set up. They have bus bars. Each battery is connected to a bus bar instead of being connected to one another. And then they have a common so sorry, each battery is connected to a common bus bar on the positive and a common bus bar on the negative. And then everything comes out at this envelope connector. So this is a little heavier duty. I think they can handle more than 100 amps. Okay, so we, and this cable is a little, they're about 35 mm. 35 mm cables versus the 25 mm cables we normally use. Um, as you can see, everything is sealed uh, to prevent um, dust and moisture from getting in. Um, here is our communication, our communication. You could do either CAN or you could do RS-485. And here is um, indicators on the side. As you can see, there are four modules and all four are lit. Pretty neat. So it tells you the SOC. Hold on, let me see. Um, bear with me. It indicates the SOC. So right now, all four are lit means it's full. And then as the battery is discharged, the SOC uh, changes. So if all four are lit, it's 100%. And then as the lights turn off, that I think is in 25% increments. Okay, with the green light or that light all the way at the bottom, it means run. That one at the bottom, even though it's blue, and then the one above it is an alarm which is not on right now. And then we've not connected PV yet. We have our um, AC breaker, our AC surge, and we have our current limiter. Um, we have some settings that allows us to customize how much we will discharge and how much we charge. On the PV side, we have our surge and we have our uh, DC breaker. So as you can see, the inverter is on. Um, let me see battery. Let me see BMS connection. Yes, we have BMS connection. It's telling battery temperature, battery current, um, state of health and state of charge. Um, and then battery charge voltage, charge current limit and this charge current limit 120 and so we cannot charge this battery anymore as it is. The grid is not present. If it were present, you see it doing something. Uh, PV hasn't been connected yet, but it will. And here is our load. There is no load yet because we've not started powering it yet. So this is a quick summary of the Jinko uh, sold to us by Palette Inc. I'll post his uh, contact below so you can contact him if you want to purchase his batteries. Uh, if you're not subscribed, please click the subscribe button. If you like what you see, please give me a thumbs up. Once again, this is Dr. Sola coming to you from Lagos, Nigeria.